Uh, tell us your name, the name of the company, and what this product is, please. This is uh, Airborne Laser, a product of North of Bremen, uh, in conjunction with Boeing and Lockheed Martin. Okay, and uh, tell us uh, what it's supposed to do. I worked on it. Well, basically, um, it's a modified 747, and the object is to place a chemical oxygen laser on the modified 747 to serve uh, ballistic missiles and ballistic uh, missile defense purposes. And, and has this been contracted for already, or it's a prototype that uh, the consortium wants uh, the government to uh, adopt? Um, uh, there's only so much information that I can say, right? But I do know that um, it's, all the juice. they're currently in production. Chemicals. Okay. Uh, and, and, and tell us a little bit about how the chemical laser works. So, uh, and show us the uh, little or, First of all, a stripped down module, uh, right. stripped down version of how a chemical laser works. Right. Uh, chemical uh, gases are fed uh, into the right right gas generator, and then it's, the it's mixed it's the way it's down. in this area. Right. Keeping the and redirect. There's a bunch of seven, mirrors seven, that, are, yeah. that so, redirect uh, the laser and amplify the light that's you know, right. passed uh, through uh, to the gun turret where it's pointed to the target. Technology. Okay, and, and uh, how, how uh, many of these uh, would be uh, uh, necessary to uh, control how large an area? I believe I'm not privy to say that. Okay, and, and is there a time frame for when this uh, system to maybe uh, field it? Um, they're currently in production now, and um, typically, um, if, I guess if schedule falls through, hopefully within the next ten, five or ten years or so. Okay, thanks very much. No problem.